the quick introduction to myself is I'm Coach Connor. I just got here this year. I'm a first year teacher and coach at Reigns Junior High. I coach uh, girls junior high volleyball, basketball, and track. Uh, celebrity lookalikes, I get told all the time that I look like John Cena everywhere I go. So it's been happening for a long time. I need to figure out how to make money off of that. So. My, what brought me to Reigns is my daughter and son are both in junior high and I've been serving in the military so I've been gone for pretty much the past three years and I wanted to be around them. And my daughter just as a whim said, why don't you come and interview and uh, see if you could get a job at Reigns and I was not, had any idea that I was going to coach and teach and I decided to just last second do it. So, Yes, uh, my hobbies are, I love to fly fish. Uh, still play baseball as much as I can and lift weights and train and with a fly fishing I try to take my kids and go fly fishing a lot and we go skiing and do that kind of stuff together so how am I enjoying my first year here at Reigns uh, it's been good I it's a lot more challenging than I thought it would be uh, schools change a lot from the last time I was in school but it's been a lot of fun uh, coaching the girls has been a blast they're uh, the, the, the girls program here is great and we've got a bunch of great seventh and eighth grade girls and so we've had it like that's absolutely been a blast and uh, teaching math is something I thought I'd never be doing and so trying to get kids to enjoy math and like that has been very challenging but it's also been uh, it's been kind of an adventure I like I like challenges and adventure so some words of wisdom for my athletes and students for my athletes it would be just outwork everybody put in a lot of time on the outside not just what you do in practice uh, and be a good person uh, for my students we just actually just finished some tests and to do good in school, you got to take stuff home and do work on it. If you don't, you do good. If you if you decide to be lazy and not do it, then you're going to struggle. And in school, you got to you got to put the time in. That's it, especially in math. So that'd be about it. Uh, probably my students don't know would be uh, I always wanted to be a professional baseball player. Thought I was going to do that forever, and then I was either going to be a special forces or baseball player, and, and decided somehow I ended up in construction, running a construction business until I decided to do the military. So I, I still own a construction company built a bunch of multi-million dollar homes and stuff and I still do that when I have time. The military life, the military life for me was great. I love it. I'm still in. I'm in the reserves now. Uh, I, it was, it's been an, an unbelievable experience. I would recommend it for just about anybody. I think that the leadership that you learn from it, that's what I love. My, my degree is actually in leadership and everything about leadership is the military and if you get that out of it, it's, it's a great experience. I've uh, I've got to see a lot of really cool places and do an amazing amount of training and uh, it's something that I would, any anybody that's thinking about doing it, I would recommend it 100%. I started, for the construction business, I started in high school working for my dad and my grandpa and it was something I swore I would never do because I did not like it, but it was also a way to, you could make a lot of money. And so through college I did it and then I got hired out while I was actually in college as a project manager and it was the degree I was pursuing. So I. I got into project management in Dallas. I worked in Dallas for years and years. And then I, about 2007, the same time my little girl was born, I decided to start my own company and started building and uh, building around Texas A&M University, built a bunch of apartments and fraternity houses and stuff. So it was a great, it was a, it was a, it was a very great learning experience, but it was also, I, I learned a lot from it. I learned that chasing money is not what life's about, chasing your dreams and doing stuff that you want to do. Because later on in life, I went back and did the stuff I wanted to do instead of just trying to make money all the time. So. This is Coach Connor signing out. Make sure you like and subscribe.